Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. By what you guys sent the title, today's video, I am gonna be showing you guys the products I use for my hair. So my hair care routine. I personally don't think it's a lot of products and a lot of them are literally like, they're sold at like the basic places. So like, you know, they're easy to get. Walmart, Target, Walgreens, Ulta, no, all those. But yeah, let's just get started before I drag this video out. I am gonna go in order. So like what I wash my hair, then what I apply after, or like, you know, after shampoo, conditioner, leave-in conditioner, you know, I'm gonna go in order. So the first two products I am gonna be talking about are my shampoos. So I actually use two. I don't know if that's a good thing. <laughs> But I mean, it's been helping my hair, so I, I'm gonna keep using both of them. So the two I use are the Shia Moisture, uh, well this is the Shia Moisture 100% Virgin Coconut Oil Daily Hydration Shampoo with Coconut Milk and Acacia, Acacia Senegal. Looks like this. I love this one. Oh my god. I just like shampoos that make my head really Is it gonna focus? Okay. I just like shampoos that make it really like foamy and soapy and this one does that. Oh my god, and it just smells so good. I love coconut, so I love this one. Then I also use the Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Castor Oil Strengthen and Restore Shampoo with Shea Butter, Peppermint, and Apple Cider Vinegar. Um, this one I'm literally almost out so I have to get yeah I have to get another one this is what it looks like um, I obviously use this one for hair growth mainly I don't think it helps with like you know with m losing hair I don't think it does I think it's just helping it grow so I'm pretty sure, yeah. I mean, anything important that I'm like forgetting right now, I'll just put it somewhere on the screen right now so you guys can see. Because I'm pretty sure I'm gonna, I'm forgetting something. So yeah, anything important, and if there isn't anything, then I'll just skip it. But yeah, just know that I'll be putting it on the screen. Okay, so after the shampoo, I don't use a conditioner. I use a mask and. I just leave it on for five minutes and I've talked to you guys about this mask before. I talked about it on my April favorites. I actually finished that one and I repurchased it. I don't know if I talked about it on my June favorites. I'm not sure. But this is the Shea Moisture Raw Shea Butter Deep Treatment Mask with Sia Kelp and Argan Oil. Oh my god. Out of everything that I have and that I'm gonna be showing you guys today, this is my favorite. Like out of everything, oh my god, this, I am so in love with it. It's just so thick and rich and it makes my hair so smooth, so silky, so shiny and oh my god, the smell. I love this smell, like it's just so, like you guys can definitely see that I've used. <laughs> A decent amount by now and I literally just opened it it's a little bit wet I've been forgetting like in the shower like I leave it open and I've just been forgetting about it so I hope it doesn't you know make it go bad I don't think so but I mean you never know so this is the Shea Moisture <laughs> I know like I have a thing with Shea Moisture but it's just the product like their product works so good for my hair so like everything i keep trying like shea moisture i keep loving it so i'm gonna you know i'm gonna obviously gonna keep buying from shea moisture if it really helps my hair but okay anyways <laughs> this is the shea moisture manuka honey and marufa oil intense hydration leave-in milk with thick extract and ba baobab oil so this is a leave-in conditioner this is what it looks like the smell of this it's not really strong and not really my favorite but since it's not strong it really doesn't you know it really doesn't make a difference 
And oh, I think I kind of skipped one. So before the leave-in conditioner, I use this. This is the Eva NYC Man Magic 10 in 1 Primer. So this is pretty much kind of like, I like to think about it kind of like a leave-in conditioner. I don't know if it says here that it can work as a leave-in conditioner. But it, like it helps detangle my hair. It just makes it super shiny and the smell of this. Oh my god These two together. It's like perfect. The smell of this alone is perfect the smell of this alone is perfect and then combine It just makes like the perfect smell It stays on for so long through my hair. I, I don't know. It's kind of surprising and one thing it said well three things it's three th th it says it strengthens, it's a heat protector and it reduces frizz. So heat protector, yes. Strengthening, I don't, strengthening, I'm not really sure. And reduce frizz, probably a little bit. My hair is really frizzy though, so I don't know if it's just this product or I just need something else. But yeah, I still really love this one. It's I love it. I used this one before the leave-in. I feel like this just makes it like more make it like soak in better maybe it's just me but it works for me and the last two products are these this is the maui moisture nourish and moisturize plus coconut milk oil um i don't know if i've talked about this before but honestly i only use this sometimes my hair is usually shiny you know it really doesn't need more shine but if i do need it I feel like my ends are a little bit dry then I use this oh my god a little bit goes a long way I at first I thought that I had to kind of spray a lot so you could like you know notice it but no like probably like a spray for your whole head is good more than enough the last product I'm gonna be talking about is the Melly I'm pretty sure it's Melly I don't know correct me if I'm wrong Millie Rosemary Mint Scalp and Hair Strengthening Oil Infused with biotin and encourages growth This is what it looks like I have seen so many people talk about this And I've always been so scared to try it because My hair is oily My scalp gets so oily so fast So I was like getting another oil for my hair I don't know if it's really going to work But oh my god I've used it Twice and those two times that I've used it, it's just, I just feel so, I, I don't know, I just feel like it works because you can literally feel it on your scalp. You can feel the mint. It feels like fresh. It feels kind of cold. Like you can feel it working. And I mean, it leaves my hair super shiny and super moisturized. So this is a plus. I still don't know about the growing Part, just because I mean I, again I've only used it twice but if it does or doesn't I'll make sure to update you guys that is it for my hair care products I really hope you guys enjoyed watching today's video and if you guys have any products that honestly help with your frizz then let me know because that is like the only thing that I have to like you know work on with my hair because I have everything else down but the frizz so my hair doesn't really look frizzy right now, but it's because I straighten it. But if I don't straighten it, it's just like, whew, and yeah, I, it's just, I need something. So make sure to comment down below to let me know anything that works for you guys so I can try it out. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video and hope to see you guys on my next one. Bye guys.